I'm a cameraman from the Netherlands. There is a really good photographer that I like is that they always say the best camera you can have is the camera you have in your pocket. Since the phone is a very a small camera, really makes it easy to uh, attach it to objects or attach it to people. I can p easily put it high, can easily put it low without too much rigging, without too much going on. It's a really nice uh, breath of fresh air to use a phone uh, to tell a story. With this new phone, the, the Mi 11, we was really inspired by the night mode, so it gave us an idea of creating some content that is based between night and day. So different uh, shooting environments uh, require different settings. So for example, if I'm shooting outside in the daytime, because there's a lot of light coming through the lens onto the sensor, and uh, that's usually too bright. So the ISO setting needs to be very low and the shutter speed needs to be very high just to deal with uh, the amount of light. Whereas if I'm shooting during the nighttime, that's a totally different uh, environment. So the, obviously the light levels are much lower. So uh, I want to higher the ISO level and lower the shutter speed to allow the sensor to receive more light. Pro mode from Xiaomi gives you these options. But sometimes that is not enough. In the last room that we shot, the diamond room, for example, it was particularly dark. So uh, in that situation, there were mirrors everywhere around. We didn't have uh, the possibility to add our own lights as they would come back in the mirrors. So in this situation, uh, the Xiaomi night mode was uh, very helpful. Since the old film is axed, around this character and uh, the, the way she, she saw the world in a different, very different and, uh, and very original, specific way. We use a lot of shots that we made in macro and we go really close to our eyes. When you're using a, uh, this phone, is that um, because the sensor compared to the regular sensors of our bigger cameras are smaller, that means that we can uh, focus very closely. Mi 11 actually have a lot of capacity for using AI, and one of them is the magic zoom. Uh, we call it actually the Hitchcock effect. Usually the, the way you use this to really create a, a very strange uh, thing that actually happening in the, in the films. So what that does is the camera moves into the subject while uh, zooming out, or it moves out from the subject while zooming in. Uh, so what that does, it keeps the framing the same size, but the relation between the foreground subject and the background subject changes. For passing from a world to another, we basically use a very, I would say, traditional way to do it. We just open the door. So the door represents the transition between our personal world and the real world. So we choose uh, to create a lighting effect. This lighting effect that we made was a sort of water reflection shimmering effect to really draw the audience in and really draw the actors in as well. So usually when I want to make a story very clear and very understandable, I use a rule of, of keys. Basically the way we do it, because our hero never sleep and she always have this, this vision. We're using the same beginning and same ending, so we totally understand there is a loop. Creativity for everyone, for me, it means that be able to shoot anything you want at any time. Whatever level they are, if they are like student or if they are professional or if they want to learn. And the best camera is the one you have in your pocket. Amazing, right? In such low light, Mi 11 can still capture such clear videos. But do you know how much technology is needed to achieve this? A one-second video taken in low light is actually the equivalent of 30 photos. If you want to take amazing videos in low light using a smartphone, you need both great hardware and software. First, the 1 over 1.3 3-inch large image sensor of the Mi 11's main camera has a larger light input. Second, when taking photos in low light, this image sensor will combine four pixels into one. This is like combining four small windows to make one large window. It allows a greater amount of light to enter the picture, 
giving you more details and a higher dynamic range. Third, the Mi 11's main camera supports OIS. This means the camera can remain balanced even when it is shaken, extending the shutter time and increasing the amount of light. This allows your shoot in low light to be more stable, and when you combine this with EIS, you get clearer images. One of the most important things we've done with Mi 11 is add a new night scene video algorithm that combines software and hardware with the Snapdragon 888 to give you an amazing videography experience even at night. Mi 11 can perform AI real-time calculations on raw level, real-time brightening, and noise reduction for every frame of your videos. Raw refers to the unprocessed original video information, which has plenty of room for adjustment. By leveraging such a powerful algorithm, Mi 11 is able to provide you with excellent low-light video quality. When it comes to night videography, Mi 11 has no boundaries. You'll be amazed by the high-quality, low-light videos that you can create with this new smartphone. Smartphones have now entered the era of computational videography. And Xiaomi is committed to providing you with the ultimate technological solutions so that we can dramatically improve the quality of your videos. Maybe in the future, you'll be able to shoot the next big blockbuster movie with just the smartphone in your pocket. Night or day, Mi 11 allows you to create amazing videos. Xiaomi. I am Kuba. I've been a Mi fan for one and a half years. I am an English teacher. And in my free time, I also like to make a movie. I also believe in the future of uh, smartphone filmmaking. It's going to boost independent films and give chance to people who wouldn't have the chance before. Having that little bit of free time and committing it to something I feel really strongly about, it makes me feel like I'm at my very special place to which I was born for. If you believe in passion and never give up, you will be surprised by what you can achieve. science fiction. But this is not fiction. This is technology. This is where smartphone communication performance is tested. All global mainstream operator networks are tested here. This is the SAR lab. It simulates the effects of electromagnetic radiation on the body, leading imaging expertise enhanced by remote tuning. An anechoic chamber exploring the limits of human hearing, thousands of ambient light conditions to create the best of displays, overcoming challenges through unrelenting effort. Through perseverance and dedication, wisdom and craftsmanship, just to exceed your expectations. This is the birthplace of Mi 11. These are Xiaomi Laboratories. This is Xiaomi Technology Park.
Did you know, in the future, factories won't need people. They'll be able to run fully autonomously 24-7. In the future, machines will work independently, seamlessly coordinating like clockwork. In the future, factories will be sealed against even the smallest speck of dust. In the future, Quality controls will be handled entirely by intelligent machines. In the future, a smartphone will be produced every second. The future needs our imagination, but more importantly, it needs our action. This is Xiaomi's one small step towards the future. The future has just begun. Xiaomi Smart Factory. Action. My name is Olivier uh, Eero Dressen. I'm from uh, Belgium. I'm a me creator. My name is Kirton. I'm a cameraman from the Netherlands. There is a really good photographer that I like this, that they always say the best camera you can have is the camera you have in your pocket. Since the phone is a very a small camera, really makes it easy to uh, attach it to objects or attach it to people. I can p easily put it high can easily put it low without too much rigging, without too much going on. It's a really nice uh, breath of fresh air to use a phone uh, to tell a story. With this new phone, the, the Mi 11, we were really inspired by the night mode, so it gave us an idea of creating some content that is based between night and day. So different uh, shooting environments uh, require different settings. So, for example, if I'm shooting outside in the daytime, because there's a lot of light coming through the lens onto the sensor, and that's usually too bright. So the ISO setting needs to be very low, and the shutter speed needs to be very high just to deal with uh, the amount of light. 
Whereas if I'm shooting during the nighttime, that's a totally different uh, environment. The, the, obviously, the light levels are much lower. So uh, I want to higher the ISO level and lower the shutter speed to allow the sensor to receive more light. Pro mode from Xiaomi gives me these options. But sometimes that is not enough. In the last room that we shot, the diamond room, for example, it was particularly dark. So uh, in that situation, there were mirrors everywhere around. We didn't have uh, the possibility to add our own lights as they would come back in the mirrors. So in this situation, uh, the Xiaomi night mode was uh, very helpful. Since the whole film is axed, around this character and the, the way she, she saw the world in a different, very different and, uh, and very original, specific way. We use a lot of shots that we made in macro and we go really close to her eyes. When you're using a, uh, this phone, is that um, because the sensor compared to the regular sensors of our bigger cameras are smaller, that means that we can uh, focus very closely. Mi 11 actually have a lot of capacity for using AI, and one of them is the magic zoom. Uh, we call it actually the Hitchcock effect. Usually the, the way you use this to really create a, a very strange uh, thing that actually happening in the, in the films. So what that does is the camera moves into the subject while uh, zooming out, or it moves out from the subject while zooming in. Uh, so what that does, it keeps the framing the same size, but the relation between the foreground subject and the background subject changes. For passing from a wall to another, we basically use a very, I would say, traditional way to do it. We just open a door, so the door represents the transition between our personal world and the real world. So we choose uh, to create a lighting effect. This lighting effect that we made was a sort of water reflection shimmering effect to really draw the audience in and really draw the actors in as well. So usually when I want to make a story very clear and very understandable, I use a rule of, of keys, basically the way we do it, because our hero never sleep and she always have this, this vision. We're using the same beginning and same ending, so we totally understand there is a loop. Creativity for everyone, for me, it means that be able to shoot anything you want at any time, whatever level they are, if they are like student or if they are professional or if they want to learn. And the best camera is the one you have in your pocket. Amazing, right? In such low light, Mi 11 can still capture such clear videos. But do you know how much technology is needed to achieve this? A one-second video taken in low light is actually the equivalent of 30 photos. If you want to take amazing videos in low light using a smartphone, you need both great hardware and software. First, the 1 over 1.3 3-inch large image sensor of the Mi 11's main camera has a larger light input. Second, when taking photos in low light, this image sensor will combine four pixels into one. This is like combining four small windows to make one large window. It allows a greater amount of light to enter the picture, giving you more details and a higher dynamic range. Third, the Mi 11's main camera supports OIS. This means the camera can remain balanced even when it is shaken, extending the shutter time and increasing the amount of light. This allows your shoot in low light to be more stable. And when you combine this with EIS, you get clearer images. One of the most important things we've done with Mi 11 is add a new night scene video algorithm that combines software and hardware with the Snapdragon 888 to give you an amazing videography experience even at night. Mi 11 can perform AI real-time calculations on raw level, real-time brightening, and noise reduction for every frame of your videos. Raw refers to the unprocessed original video information which has plenty of room for adjustment. By leveraging such a powerful algorithm, Mi 11 is able to provide you with excellent low-light video quality. When it comes to night videography, Mi 11 has no boundaries. You'll be amazed by the high-quality, 
low-light videos that you can create with this new smartphone. Smartphones have now entered the era of computational videography. And Xiaomi is committed to providing you with the ultimate technological solutions so that we can dramatically improve the quality of your videos. Maybe in the future, you'll be able to shoot the next big blockbuster movie with just the smartphone in your pocket. Night or day, Mi 11 allows you to create amazing videos. Xiaomi. I am Kuba. I've been a Mi fan for one and a half years. I am an English teacher. And in my free time, I also like to make a movie. I also believe in the future of uh, smartphone filmmaking. It's going to boost independent films and give chance to people who wouldn't have the chance before. Having that little bit of free time and committing it to something I feel really strongly about, it makes me feel like I'm at my very special place to which I was born for. If you believe in passion and never give up, you will be surprised by what you can achieve. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Welcome to today's spring new product release. I'm so excited. Today is one of the greatest new product release of Xiaomi, and we have got a lot of new product to release. And joining us 
joining us, we have uh, uh, people from 50 countries as well as over 40 live stream platforms and we also provide live streams in seven languages. So this is the biggest and the greatest new product release of Xiaomi. Thank you very much for participation from around the world. In the past one year, it was a difficult year. With the support from the global Mi fans, Xiaomi has registered remarkable results. Last week, we just published the financial reports, and I am excited to tell you about the achievements made in the past one year. First, the total earning in 2020 amounted to 245.9 billion Chinese yuan. Xiaomi, a 10-year-old company, can reach this number. I feel so proud and excited. I think we definitely created another business record in the history, especially in a so difficult year like last year. We still registered a 19.4% year-on-year growth, which is remarkable. So today, I would love to share with you that we have also made two important achievements in the smartphone business. First, the shipment of uh, Xiaomi smartphone went back to the top three in the markets in the world. Secondly, early last year, we started to move into the high-range market. In just one year, we launched five high-rangers. After the launch of each mobile phone, they were warmly received by the Mi fans. I think we have found a foothold in the high-range market. Among the five smartphones, especially Mi 11, which was launched a couple of months ago, was warmly received by our users. It's ultra l lightweight and the thin design, the 2K display and the flagship performance were highly rec recognized by the Mi fans. In just 21 days, the sales exceeded 1 million units. This is a high-range flagship smartphone, so the sales exceeded 1 million units in just 21 days. This is a remarkable result. Today, we are going to launch the big and bigger surprise of uh, Mi 11. First, I'm going to introduce to you the Mi 11 Pro. Mi 11 Pro, its designed target is to become the king of androids. Later, you can take a look and you will see whether we can call it the king of androids. Now let's take a look at this smartphone. It comes in three color variants. I like the green color especially because it represents the season of spring. Let's take a look at the green variant. Beautiful, isn't it? The design elements of uh, this smartphone inherit the tradition of uh, the Xiaomi lineup. Moreover, the color of uh, this smartphone is also refreshing. And uh, this is a picture of the actual smartphone. At the same time, it also comes in purple with AG frosted glass, which is a suit great match uh, with young people. Both men and uh, women can use it. And we also have the classic black. So this time, Mi 11 Pro comes in three color variants. The display of Mi 11 Pro is like Mi 11, is a top level display. This is a AMOLED quad curved 
display. It uses E4 materials, and this is the latest technology in 2021. And this display supports 2K HD display. It also has a refreshing refresh rate of 120 hertz. Such a best-in-class display. We participated in the display evaluation, and we got A plus score in the evaluation. This time, in this display, it is also boosted by Dolby Vision. This technology, in terms of contrast, color, and the brightness, looks vivid. Its effect is stunning. In the past, we mainly used this technology on laptop and TV, but this is the first time that we introduce this technology to smartphones to create a better viewing experience. Such a fine display is also protected by the latest technology of Corning, which is the Corning Gorilla Glass Victus. Its anti-scratch performance is 1.5 times better, and its uh, impact-resistant performance is two times better than the previous edition. With such a strong protection, the mobile phone will be easy to use, but this is far from enough. Upon shipment, we will also apply a cold curve screen protector to the mobile phone. It is antibacterial screen protector, and also in the box, uh, it comes with an antibacterial case. So this is the top-notch display of uh, Mi 11 Pro. It also supports the stereo dual speaker, and we have sound by Harman Kardon. All these represent the experience of the king of Android. What about the performance? This is also your concern. It is powered by Qualcomm Snapdragon 888. This is the best mobile platform in the world. Talking about Snapdragon 888, people might be concerned about the energy efficiency and battery life. In the past, we usually run the benchmark score evaluation. Now, recently, people like to run the Genshin impact. Now, let's run the Genshin impact on our mobile phone. Maybe many users don't know Genshin impact is one of the most popular mobile games. It has very high requirements to the performance of uh, the mobile phone. Many people say that Genshin Impact is already the latest evaluation tool for the performance of the mobile phone. And we select the extreme image quality and we test it for 30 minutes. And we want to challenge the gaming device directly. So we want to compete with two gaming smartphones in the market, and we can run on 58 or 59 FPS, and we run the game for 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, this phone's temperature stands at 50.9 degrees, and this one is 52.7 degrees Celsius. I think we all know the Mi 11 Pro will be way better. Let's see the temperature. It is 49.3 degrees. To show you this, I want to tell you that Mi 11 Pro is very strong in its heat dissipation performance. Let's take a closer look. First, it has a large vapor chamber. More importantly, it has a new phase heat conduction material. The heat conduction property is improved by 100%. So this is the liquid cool system. And I prepared a short video as an explanation of technology. the 将热量高效导出至VC液冷板 
really good. Snapdragon 888 2K display, 120 Hz refresh rate. This is the top level configuration of uh, the flagship phone. So these features are great, but they also consume a lot of energy. Now flagship phones equipped with these features, in addition to Mi 11, usually struggles with battery life. Well, let's take a look at the battery life of Mi 11 Pro, right? To resolve the issue of a battery life, first, it is supported by a 5000 mAh battery. Let's make some comparison. Talking about battery life, without comparison, you don't feel anything. We want to test the phone by using the mobile phone for five hours heavily. So the data of Mi 11 Pro comes from our laboratories and the test result of other smartphones actually come from other test institutions. This comparison is only to show you the actual situation. We don't want to crush any competitors, so please make no mistakes. And I, I also suggest that maybe we don't need to make any comparison, but without comparison, uh, we all say we have a better battery life. And even if we use notary office, people won't buy the result. Therefore, we will use the third-party test result as a comparison. So these are the flagship smartphones from different vendors, and we test the phones for five hours heavily. You see the results. The other three smartphones cannot last for five hours, but the remaining battery of Mi 11 is 15 percent and the remaining battery of Mi 11 Pro stands at 21 percent. Remarkable. And we are curious about the real battery life of this phone. Can we compare it to iPhone? Can we compare it with other smartphones of uh, other win vendors? Can we compare it with smartphones equipped with uh, Snapdragon 870? Many people would say the battery life of 888 is not as good as Snapdragon 870s, but it depends on whose phone it is. Let's see the result of the comparison. So we rank number three among all the flagships, and the first two are still the Xiaomi lineup. Therefore, don't say the battery life of 888 is not good. It depends on whose phone who is uh, the manufacturer of uh, the smartphone. So I think we can come to a conclusion that in terms of uh, performance, heat, dissipation, and battery life, it is equi uh, the Mi 11 Pro is equivalent to gaming phones. It is indeed the king of Androids. Let's take another look at the 5,000 mAh battery. You might have the fear that it might be heavy and clumsy. Let's take a closer look. It is only slightly heavier and thicker than Mi 11, but we have 5000 mAh battery. And the data is on the left hand side. You can take a picture of it. But it is only 8.53 mm thick and uh, it is only 208 gram heavy. It is incredible to do this. Why? Because we debuted a latest battery in the world. It has a higher power density, smaller size, and a faster charging efficiency. So during our warm-up, we already mentioned that with this battery, it is actually the cutting-edge technology in the battery technology called silicon oxygen anode battery. It is also released with the new energy vehicles. And by the application of this, this kind of battery, the energy efficiency is greatly improved. And also we have adopted the MTW 20 tab fast charge battery, and we have reached 20 tab. And so in terms of the battery technology, we have a lot of other advanced technologies, and I wouldn't elaborate on it. 
But with this new type of battery, actually with this 8.55 millimeter, we have a 5,000 milliamps battery, and we also prepare this 67 watt wired fast charging technology. So. We may ask by the fans that why don't you use 120 watt? It is also released for the first time last year by Xiaomi. So with our Mi 11 Pro, it's, there's a simple philosophy because we need to keep a balance with the battery capacity with the uh, thickness. So we want to create this 5,000 milliamps battery, but we want to avoid it to be too oversized. And also we want to keep the high efficiency and so our battery charging department did confirmed the 67 watt charging technology. And it is also astonishing because it takes only 36 minutes to charge it to 100%. And so as a result, this is why we decided to use this 67 watt fast charge. And I want to share with you another thing for the very first time, because we are also releasing the 67 watt wireless fast charging mode. And in recent years, Xiaomi has been leading the wireless charging technology in the world, and it is a, has a top-notch technology. And with this wireless charging, we have the six times supercharging technology. I won't elaborate on it because I don't want to make this uh, launch as a lecture. But we do have uh, our detailed introductions with detailed configurations. And the test result actually surprised me because it is actually on par with the wired charging technology. It has almost the same charging efficiency. Do you believe it? Let's have a look. With our wired charging technology against our wireless 67 watt charging mode. surprise. So with our wireless charging mode, it all also takes 36 minutes, which is incredible. So now, in order to cope with the release of Mi 11 Pro, we're also introducing this wireless charging stand to you, which is also very powerful, with a power efficiency of 80 watt. And also it has this outstanding appearance looks very nice. It looks really beautiful. And so with this wireless charging stand, I believe you all remember that because in the past, we, you, we need to match the mobile phone with the charging stand. And we had made major breakthrough in this, but I also get some feedbacks from the Mi fans who are fans of TV series. They can only charge the phone by placing it vertically on the charging stand. So now we are making this possible. You can place it horizontally or vertically. This might be a small enhance to the user experience, but it is really much more convenient. And can you imagine how much effort is behind this simple change? I, I find it really uh, amazing. And they introduced how we did this. There are two different charging devices within this charging stand, and we want to achieve this breakthrough at all costs. So I find our engineers really lovely at Xiaomi, and I have so many stories to tell about this. And so with this 80 watt wireless charging stand in the box, there is also a 120 watt charger. With this set, it is actually representing the top-notch quality of wireless charging.
devices because we are all talking about environment friendly concept because this is the best of the best in wireless charging. It is a little expensive because it also costs more to produce it. And also, there's also a environmental friendly standard version without any cable or charger inbox. Because if you already have charger and cable at your home or in your office, then I would suggest you to have this environment friendly version. And if you don't have the chargers, we have a set with the same price. And so now I'd like to recommend the wireless charging stand one more time to you because there are people who have never experienced the fun of wireless charging stand. You simply need to place your phone on it and the charging starts. And even if your friends are using iPhone, they can also borrow your charging stand. Because I was telling them, if you are giving for free uh, an extra charger, maybe you can give this one. But they said this one is much more expensive. So how about we provide an extra discount to our users? And I said yes. So this is our special offer. You only need to add another 199 RMB. But I need to explain to you, because our supply chain department has informed me that we have limited numbers of this charging stand. So we would sell it in a first come, first served manner. And also in the coming one year, I believe, even in several years, it won't be outdated. So I would sincerely recommend you this 80 watt wireless charging stand. And I believe we should give a bonus to our charging department because they also have a wired version. And so do you know what this one is? This is like a magical technology because normally you, when you need to charge it with a wireless charging pad or charger, you need to match the positions with the coils. So we were thinking about, like there are different companies, for example, they are using mag magnet charging technologies. But with our wireless charging pad, you simply need to place your phone on it and the charging starts. And before this, actually, we have this uh, wireless charging pad that automatically search for your phone. And you may still have the uh, impression. But although it's good, but actually the mechanism is running for several seconds. Can be a little stressful, but this one is much more convenient. And also it could charge three different devices simultaneously. Isn't that nice? And you don't hear any sound from the motor. The moment you place it on it, the charging starts. What is the re reason behind it? You will find it funny because there are 19 charging coils. 19 coils. You can place it anywhere. And I ask if there is any pattern with it. It is actually with precise calculation. And altogether, there are 19 coils to guarantee that you can just leave it on the charging pad. And once I release this secret, you may say that we didn't do much. And it is not equipped with any advanced technology. But what is the most difficult part? It is the overheating issue. Because it also takes us two years. It is not an easy task. So for our tech fans, if you want to have a feeling of this wireless charging pad, I would recommend this multi-coil wireless charging pad to you. It is 599 RMB. And so up to now, I know you might have some concern about our pro uh, cameras, the camera technologies. We have an unparalleled camera array. 
you will feel astonished. I will remind you to get prepared for this. So, what is the camera system like for 11 Pro? It is the GN2. This is the legendary GN2, the first de debut globally. So for people who are not that interested in the uh, digital technologies, I would introduce to you one more time. So GN2 has this uh, super, size, super sensor size, which is close to one inch. Let's have a look. So it is 1.12 inch, inches, because normally for cameras, it is always one inch. This one is close to one inch. So let's have a look at the sensor size of iPhone 12 Pro. So ours is five times the size of a iPhone 12 Pro. So there's a saying in camera industry, which is saying that the, the larger your sensor size is, the more powerful it is. So the sensor is actually jointly developed by Xiaomi and Samsung for 18 months, and we have invested over 200 million RMB into it. So it has a 50 megapixel, and actually we have uh, over one, 1 trillion pixel resolutions, and each pixel is 1.4 micrometer. It also supports a 4-in-1 super pixel, which is 2.8 micrometer, which is the biggest pixel to date, so that at, with night mode and dim light mode and even backlight mode, it has a splendid performance. And to achieve this, we have a eight pieces lens, which composes six, uh, which composes eight different pieces. And also we have adopted this OIS technology. And also we have another advanced technology, which is called the Dual Pixel Pro, which is a cutting edge technology with such technology, independent from what the ambient environment is, it could release a, f a sharp focus. And I would like to introduce with a small video clip. Shang So isn't that magical? Actually, it has a really fast and sharp focus. And also the HDR technology is very advanced. There are two major technologies. The first one is the dual native ISO fusion, which is derived from the most high-end professional camera. And also, we have this fusion technology with our smartphone. The second one is the Steiger HDR. It is a technical term, so I won't elaborate on it. But the biggest advantage is that with the big light ratio, for example, in a, in a cave, with a strong contrast inside and outside, you might have a problem taking a clear image. And I believe you have all encountered with such environment. But with a, some, with a Mi 11 Pro, you can deal with this problem perfectly. So let's, I would like to show you some actual shots taken by Mi 11 Pro. So this is the African continent. You see the sunlight, the clouds afar, as well as the alpaca near. Everything is so clear. Let's feel the beauty of nature. Such a backlight photography actually poses challenge to the camera function of a, of a camera. And this is the snow mountain. You see the snow mountain afar and the lake near. 
And if this is a long exposure fossil, and this is the snow melting, and you see the water in the creek is flowing. In this forest, the photographer also met a very cute animal. This is a fox. The fox was curious about our camera. It stared at our camera. You see, its eyes are fixed on our camera. So the photographer took a group of uh, photos of this fox. Moreover, because of the super big sensor size of GN2, you will see very good performance in low light condition. This is a Gobit desert. And there is light source on the side, but still we will be able to capture the starry nights. This is incredible for a mobile camera. GN2 is strong in process the low light condition. We also took a portrait photo under low light condition. You see all the details. If we zoom in, you can even see the details and the textures of the sweater. So clear. And we also took another picture under the light. Also very beautiful. You see the complexion of the lady, the eyelash of the lady. So we can still see so many details under lights. Therefore, if you use the 11 Pro's camera to take a picture in low light condition, you will be surprised. The camera system of Mi 11 Pro also possess the ultra wide angle camera and the tele photo camera. Now let's look at the ultra wide angle. For ultra wide angle, people like this feature. It is suitable to take a picture of the big scene and also you feel a lot of tension in the picture. So this is a rider making a turn in the desert very quickly and you see the sand behind it. Magnificent. Many people are skiing fans. We know when we're skiing, we're actually going very fast. This is also a challenge for the camera performance, but the camera of uh, Mi 11 Pro can take a very clear picture even when it's very fast. And uh, you can also use it to take a picture of the scenery. This is the city view. At dawn, the day is growing dark and uh, the lights along the road are just turned on and you see the traffic on the flyover. This is such a beautiful picture. Mi 11 Pro is also boosted by the 50 times tele macro lens for the king of androids. So the tele macro lens is just part of its uh, capability. The difficult part is to embed these feature into the phone. So the tele macro lens is a very big lens. But Mi 11 Pro is only 8.5 millimeters thick. It still has the tele macro lens in it. In addition, it is also boosted by five times optical zoom and OIS. Let's take a look at this picture. So this is a ultra wide angle picture. And uh, if we zoom in by 50 times, you see two people are sitting in a boat. We record the whole process of taking this picture and you can take a look. Great, isn't it? And uh, another scene where you will use your camera very often, that is taking a flight. And you are sitting by the window and you see the beautiful landscape down there and you can't help taking out your phone and take a picture. If your camera is not the top level flagship phone, this is the picture you're going to get. But this is uh, Mi 11 Pro. If you zoom in by 10 times, take a closer look. This is the Yellow River. This time we took a picture of the Yellow River. Mi 11 Pro 
also supports 8K video shooting. It is very strong in shooting videos, and we've got a video to demonstrate the 8K video shooting feature. Incredible. These are pictures taken by smartphones. So, if you buy the Mi 11 Pro, you will be able to create your own 8K video, which is going to be magnificent. And for video shooting, we also support 1920 FPS super slow motion. In super slow motion, you will be able to capture details you can't capture in the past, and you will be able to see the beauty of life. Next video will be very interesting. I watched the video and then I learned how dogs drink water. Very interesting. So this is Mi 11 Pro's camera module. Very powerful. But due to time limit, I can only give you a brief introduction of it. Now, let's look at the unique experience of Mi 11 Pro. First, the IP68. This is the first time for Xiaomi to launch an IP68 smartphone. IP68 is the highest standard for dust and waterproof of electronic devices, and Mi 11 Pro got the Rhineland IP68 certification in the 1.5 meter deep water. Uh, we put it there for 30 minutes, the phone is still properly functional. IP68 has very high requirements for components. It also has high requirements for the testing procedures. The production of the IP6 device must be tested for uh, impermeability and the factory must be dust free. Therefore, it is difficult to realize IP68. The first time we developed the IP68 device, the engineer had a lot of great ideas, but when we did the test in the laboratories, we found uh, the Mi 11 Pro is very strong in its waterproof performance. Therefore, the marketing department made an extreme deep water test. They went to the deepest swimming pool in the world, Y40 and they want to challenge the impermeability of uh, Mi 11 Pro. And we will see when the phone will be dead in 1.5, 10 meters or 40 meters. Guess how deep can Mi 11 Pro dive? 
we actually took a video of the test, and you can see how deep Mi 11 Pro can dive. Actually, I really admire that diver because he dived 42 meters without the oxygen tank. So he stayed in the water for five or six minutes. Really incredible. I was amazed at this video when I saw it for the first time. So me, 11 Pro, can dive 42 meters deep in the water. Therefore, we believe Mi 11 Pro is very strong in its waterproof performance. But here, I would like to say that any IP68 device is not permanent because IP68 has high requirement and a mobile phone is a sophisticated device. The damage and fall of the phone in your daily use might reduce the impermeability of the phone. So there is still the risk that the water might get into your water. So be careful. But then many people might ask, why do you want to make it IP68? We make it IP68 because we want to improve the quality of the smartphone and reduce the possibility of the phone damage caused by water. So if you are going to take a picture underwater, I still suggest that you buy yourself a waterproof case. And we use the Mi 11 Pro to take some interesting pictures without the waterproof case. Let's take a look. What fish is it? Yes. It is Nemo. What about this? This is mullet, right? Okay, actually, I don't know what fish it is. And this? Okay, you all know it. Mi 11 Pro also supports Wi-Fi 6 Enhanced. Wi-Fi 6 Enhanced is very powerful. Its transmission capability can reach up to 3.5 Gbps. Many Mi fans say they don't understand this, but no problem. If you download a 1 gigabyte movie, it only takes 5.3 seconds. Of course, in order to use it, you need a router that is compatible with Wi-Fi 6 enhanced. So here, I want to recommend you the best Mi router. The Mi router AX9000. AX9000. I don't know whether you understand what this name stands for. At first I thought it was just a name, but later I learned that AX stands for Wi-Fi 6 and 9000 stands for the transmission capability of this router. It supports up to 9000 megabyte rate. And it also has this designated gaming frequency. That means with this uh, triple band, it will not disturb the other bands. And it is extremely powerful. And so it is actually the most uh, 
And actually, it has a 12 antenna, advanced uh, antenna, and also 12 signal amplifiers. And the first time they show, they have shown me this, I was asking them that there are only four that I could see, but they told me that for each triangle, it contains three uh, antennas. So I was asking them, why don't you use 12 different antennas? And maybe they think it's not looking good enough. So I think our engineers have their own understanding about design and they have their bottom lines. And so with this Mi router, it is also powered by the most powerful flagship processor. It has this uh, hexa core with four, C four core CPU and two core GPU, and the price is 999 RM, Chinese RMB. And with the most high-end routers, I think it is uh, the one that is most worthwhile. And so we have this lineup of all our hybrid mesh uh, network, and from AX1800 to this AX9000, actually it can automatically match with the hybrid mesh network with any two different devices. So, powered by our AX9000, our Mi uh, 11 Pro has a really powerful band bandwidth. So let's have another look at our Mi 11 Pro. What are the advantages of it? I've managed to compare it to our Mi 11, and all the parts marked in yellow are the uh, new, newly enhanced functions and features. And you can imagine that actually it carry on the legacy of Mi 11 in the following terms. For example, the 2K display and the flagship level performance as well as this delicate design. But at the same time, there is a great breakthrough and enhancement, which means actually there are four different debut because I killed some of it due to the time limit. So what are these four major breakthroughs? Let's have a look together. The first one is the GN2 uh, sensor size and also our silicon oxygen anode battery and our new phase, phase change and also 67 watt wireless charging. With all these advanced technologies, with their debut, it is also our first IP68 smartphone. It is also the first smartphone that supports Dolby Vision. With all these high-end configurations, we would call it the king of Android. So now you may be wondering about the price of this smartphone. So normally I'll, we would compare with our competitors, but now I will just show you the price directly. The price is 4,999 Chinese RMB. So without any comparison with our competitors, I would believe that it would be the goalkeeper for the high-end smartphone. And the, those are the three different editions with the prices. And so with this smartphone, we have also carefully designed three different cases. The first one is a vegan leather case. With our Mi 11 Pro, with its powerful functions, I will give you uh, the summary with all the advanced technologies. Maybe you can take a picture and refer to it later because we have a lot of other products. And please allow me to show you this summary. And you can have a closer look at it later. So do you want to see the actual smartphone? I will give you a demonstration now. So this is my favorite with green color. It looks really beautiful. And also the case also looks elegant. It is a vegan leather case I mentioned. So from your feedbacks, actually we have this uh, extra protector for our GN2 lens, GN2 camera. 
And so I got the feedback that people are saying that the camera can be easily scratched. That's why we added this design. And I was a little worried about whether it will look good or not. But now I think it really looks nice. And it is extremely thin. It is 8.53 millimeter. And so actually it has a really a comfort grip when you hold it in your hand. Thank you. And so what is the next one we want to introduce to you? It's a Mi 11. It's a bigger surprise. Mi 11 Ultra. So the Mi 11 Pro is called the king of Android. So we have a we will shoot an even higher goal with Mi 11 Ultra. We want to be the ultimate of Android. So shall we have a look at our video clip first? So let's first have a look at the appearance and the design. So with this design, when you take the first glimpse at it, it might be a little exaggerated because it is really unique. It's a little overwhelming, but there's one thing good about it because it looks like a high-end smartphone and it is really recognizable. It is one of a kind. And also, it is made with fine ceramic and it is a advanced and also delicate. Let's have a look at all the details. So that's the fine ceramic in black. We also have the white version. Does it look nice? So when you look at it first, you will feel overwhelmed. But for me, after a few days, I, I only feel that it is really beautiful and elegant. Maybe you think the images are enhanced. So how about the actual smartphones? I will give you some actual pictures. Looks really beautiful. How about the white one? The white ceramic is also really beautiful. And with such a unique design, it is all serving the purpose of ultimate, the ultra camera. So what is so good about it? So when you look at it, you will already be in impressed with it because it has the triple prograde cameras. There are three cameras. The first one is the GN2, the ultra-wide camera, the IMX586, ultra-wide, and also it has a pro-grade 100 times telemicro camera. When you put these three cameras together, we are being challenged by how we place these three extreme cameras together. And also we have equipped the DTOF technology for the very first time. And this is the first time that Xiaomi is using the DTOF technology for a high-end smartphone. And all of these three cameras are able to capture 8K videos. And first of all, it is powered by the DTOF technology and also a brand new 64 point array laser focus. It has an even 
bigger field of view and which is possible to shoot longer distance. And do you still remember about the uh, Mi 10 Ultimate? It is with a single point, but this one has a 64 point array and the FOV is as wide as 61 degrees and it has a really sharp focus. So with such advanced technology, I would like to introduce to you another function, which is the ultra night photos algorithm. How powerful is this algorithm? So when you sh take a photo for the first time, you will be able to get an image that has the equivalent quality of a photo taken by a tri tripod for a consecutive 30 seconds and also supported by the sensor size of GN2, it will be comparable to the professional cameras. The first one is already impressive enough. So it, it has this cin cinematic shots. And you can see that on a rainy day, this girl is sitting in the car, and you could see the raindrops, which is crystal clear. So it is really overwhelming. And the second image taken is also good enough to be placed on the cover page of magazines. You can even see the beard of the, the guy, some in white color. And so with this night mode function, it is really powerful. And also, we have this 120 times periscope tele micro camera and this is a sunrise on the sea we say my uh, tele micro camera you could see the reflection of the sunlight and this is also taken with the tele micro ca camera which is on the summit of a mountain it looks so far but it on the picture it is nearer than the actual distance. And also, we took the chance to take the high rises in cosmopolitan and with this long focal length. And when we zoom in, I saw that it is from Holi. And even at night, it shows a splendid performance. For example, this overpass, it has a really translucent color and when you zoom in, you can even see the traffic signs. This is with the uh, five times telemicro. Can you tell which city it is? So I asked the photographer. It was shoot in Guangzhou. And also, we have made a record of, of how this 120 times telemicro camera is taking a, a photo. So after this video, I was wondering, uh, because how come we are seeing this video chart on the top of this high-rise? I was really curious, and I even asked the photographer, and he, he explained that this building might be a hospital for eye care. So it is a good advertisement with this video chart. But I was a little shocked because on this image, when you zoom in, you find this video chart. I think this is a amazing idea. With macro lens, you can also shoot 8K video. And uh, we got an 8K video shot about...
So you can use this periscope lens to take very beautiful scenery pictures. Next is uh, the ultra wide angle camera. It can reach up to 128 degrees. The first picture I would like to show you is a beautiful girl sitting in the boat and the snow has yet to melt and you see in the ultra wide angle camera everything looks magnificent and uh, these are two horses standing on the sand hill and you see the clear sky and the vast land and this one this one is a great test to the lens this is actually a backlight photo the sunlight what goes through the forest, it looks beautiful. With such a fine camera module, you can go out more often to take pictures and you will be able to feel the beauty of nature as well as the beauty of life. Such a great camera system, for it we also developed a lot of great functions. For example, multi-cam. You can turn on all the cameras to shoot at the same time. You can choose different zoom, you can even open the front camera and then you select the two cameras you want to use to shoot. And uh, for Mi 11 Ultra, we also add another cool feature to it, which can be used by professional directors. So two Mi 11 Ultras can be used to shoot at the same time. So with multi-cam and with dual phone recording as a professional director, as a vlog fan, you will be able to capture more details and beautiful, more beautiful images. And we also got a video as a demonstration for you.一部手机，同时拍摄出两个视角的视频，更立体全面的呈现你想记录的难忘瞬间。不同是拥有动态与静态的丰富画面，尽可特写，远可沉浸，仿佛专业片场里的多机位连拍，最适合记录不可多得的
honestly, I removed those slides because I think it might be boring. So, when you get your Mi 11 Ultra, you can make your own comparison. Mi 11 Ultra is designed, targeted to become the ultimate of Android, and we want to become the peak of all Android devices. You know our target. Now that we want to create a mobile phone that is beyond the mobile phone, this is a goal that is so un unexpected, should we compare our camera system with the professional camera? In the past, if we compare the mobile camera with the professional camera, it is a taboo. And uh, the camera department also told me that don't do it because you will be criticized. Because the professional camera is way much better than the mobile camera in terms of hardware but this time for Mi 11 Ultra we have a sensor size close to one inch even though we are slightly behind the professional camera in terms of hardware but we're very close moreover we have a strong algorithm team and uh, also we are very strong in photography computational algorithm therefore I think we can make the comparison and today is a very special moment. I think right now we are standing at the turning point of the war between the mobile camera and the professional camera. No matter whether we can win this comparison with professional camera, it is not important but at least there is one mobile camera that stands out to do the comparison. This is why I call this the turning point. And we selected a professional camera for this comparison. The Sony RX 100M7. This is a highly recognized uh, professional camera. We disassembled the camera and we found that the sensor size of Sony is um, very similar to ours, just slightly bigger than ours. And we did a lot of tests and uh, comparison in different scenarios. Let's take a look. So this is a picture taken by professional camera. And this is a night view. For professional camera, Night view is a big, the biggest challenge for it. And this is the picture taken by Mi 11 Ultra. Which one is better? First time I saw this comparison, I was also surprised. If we zoom in, see the neon lights. You see, the picture taken by Mi 11 Ultra is much better than that of Sony. Now let's take a look at another comparison. So, with such a high contrast of light. You see the picture taken by Mi 11 Ultra, and if we zoom in, you see clearly the grid, the squares on the building, but you see the picture taken by Sony was too much exposed. And I, we made so many comparisons, but in the interest of time, I removed other examples from the presentation. Actually, I want our friends from media to compare Mi 11 Ultra with the professional camera. Today, we have a very powerful photography computational algorithm. So the progress of a mobile camera is way beyond our imagination. We just looked at two examples, and you think it's not enough. If you think, maybe we just uh, singled out the examples that favors us, but actually uh, we made a lot of comparison. I think in over 90% of the scenarios, Mi 11 Ultra will win the comparison. If you don't buy it, we can do the test on site, right here, right now. Do you want to try it right here, right now? Okay, I will turn it over to our colleague from camera department. He is over there. Can you see him? Are you ready? 
I mean, our colleague. Are you ready? Okay. Let's turn off the lights. And、uh, we use Mi 11 Ultra to take a picture first. Are you done? Then let's take a picture with、uh, the RX 100M7. If you are finished, can you、uh, pull up the picture taken by Sony M7, and we can take a look? You see it? This is the picture taken in a almost totally dark environment. Actually, there is a picture placed on the wall. You see, so this is a picture taken on site just now. You like this camera? So we're not bluffing. Today, mobile camera is on par with professional camera. Of course, we still have a long way to go in the future. So you see. The image effect of a Mi 11 Ultra is much better than the professional camera. Do you want to、uh, try it another?、Uh, do you want to try it again? So change to another background, and we can run the test again. So let's change to another test scene, because there are different colors, different objects, and the different characters for the test purpose. All right, let's turn off the lights. So first, let's take a picture with the Mi 11 Ultra, and then we take another picture with、uh, the RX 100 M7, and then we pull up the picture taken by Sony RX 100 M7. Oh, I thought. Something wrong.、Uh, something went wrong with、uh, Sony's camera because、uh, Sony's camera is quite good. So let's take a look at the picture taken by Sony. So the professional camera is still very good. You feel the magic of technology, right? In the past few years, Xiaomi has made so much progress in camera technology that is beyond your imagination. Last year, we have over 1,000 engineers in the camera department, and we have over 100、uh, AI engineer in our AI department. And this year, we are going to have over 2,000 people in the camera department. We have invested so much in it because of our huge investment. We have made rapid progress in the camera technology. Last year, one third of the time, in the XO marks. Uh, photography evaluation. Xiaomi ranked number one in the world. Therefore, over the past few years, Xiaomi has made incredibly rapid progress. Therefore, I really hope that you can make the comparison. If you find any scenarios uh, uh, in which we are not as good as、uh, the professional camera, please tell us. So far. Let's come back、uh, to the point why we name、uh, the phone Mi 11 Ultra.、Uh, my English is not very good. Do you know the meaning of ultra? I looked up in the dictionary. Ultra means extreme. Therefore, we name the this device ultra because we want to explore the ceiling, the limit of a mobile camera. So we might have some far-fetched goals and ambitions with Ultra because we are aiming at doing something that is beyond the imagination and capability of others. And now we are arriving at this turning point of smartphone and cameras. And so, with the strong technology of Xiaomi, I would believe that some that Mi 11. Ultra will be the ultimate of Android.
，小米十一爆出。一点一二分之一英寸，堪比相机的超级大底，带来前所未有的感光量，用极致画质，让你第一次看清楚黑。小米十一 Ultra， 巅峰影像，安卓之光。So that's the peak of camera technologies, and that is the goal of our product. So let's have another look at the design. Does it already look familiar to you? But actually, why are we looking at this rear display and? They even claim that we are copying from others. It is a little bit annoying for us. So, what is the function of this rear display? Actually, it has several different functions. For example, it can demonstrate various information. But the reason we design it is for selfie. So, can you imagine that with this triple pro-grade cameras? Could any smartphone achieve this? So actually, for we have our front camera, but if you like it, you can even use this rear camera to take a selfie. And this is with the ultra wide angle camera. It is really impressive. And actually, with this rear display, there's an extra function because we define our uh. Mi 11 Ultra as the tech fans and geeks of our products, so they might encounter scenarios like overseas and in the wild. So we have the super power saver mode with only 10% of the power. It has a battery life of over 55 hours, and this is a really considerate arrangement. And this function, I want to, I want you to understand our intention. So with Mi 11 Ultra, in all possible aspects, is showing the top-notch technology of this industry, and in all possible aspects, it has been the smartphone that has the best performance. And I would like to show you some details. The first one, the display, it has the high-end display, and it could be the most expensive. Display to date in the market, and the second thing is it is powered by this 5,000 milliamps battery and a 6,67 watt wired turbo charging, as well as a 67 watt wireless turbo charging. It is even thinner than 11 Pro. What is the reason? It's because it is made with the refined ceramics, which could be even thinner than the glass. Although we have this big camera, it is not that we don't want to test the limit, but the cameras has this fixed size. But we want to show something different. And do you agree with me? And so, with this smartphone, we also have this dual stereo. Speaker and which is collaborated and sounded by Harman Kardon. It also supports IP68, and that is the ultimate camera. The the ultra of Android, and with this unique smartphone, what could be the price? I think we don't need to compare it with any competitor anymore. And so, our price is five thousand nine hundred ninety-nine RMB yuan. And here, so as we define it as the ultra ultra of Android, we might compare it with other ultra products. But we think we are a different version of ultra, and we have these three different editions. 
It is a、uh, Eight gigabyte plus two hundred fifty six gigabytes is five thousand and nine hundred and ninety nine, with a twelve gigabyte plus two hundred fifty six, with a price six hundred and four six thousand four hundred ninety nine Chinese RMB. We also have this ceramic edition, and a marbled ceramic special edition. And so on the ceramics. It shows a pattern of the marble, and this technique is also a bold attempt of our design department. And so, I have. This is why we are presenting this marble, marbled ceramic edition. It is. It has the same price, which is six thousand nine hundred ninety-nine RMB. It is the same as the ceramic edition. And also, we have two different cases. The first one is this vegan leather case, which could protect your expensive camera. And the other one is designed especially for young people like I am. It is the mirror-like flip case. And I remember that last year, early last year, I invented, I created this flip case. And people were criticizing about this. Now, now you can see this is what you like and this is what I like. But I also like this vegan like leather case. That's a ceramic white. It looks extremely gorgeous. It is really thin. That's the ceramic case. And with this new type of battery. The, it has been enhanced. Although with the high-end flagship level performance, we are making a lot of efforts to make our phones thinner. So does it look good? The other one is also nice, and it is. It provides a special protection of the lens. And so I would highly suggest that you would buy a case to protect your expensive camera. And once it's broken, so for for me, I would say it's always a a pity if you break it. So also there is a case in the box, and if you like this vegan leather case, it also doesn't cost much. And so, for more functions, I made this summary on this slide, and you can take a picture by yourself to see all the other functions. And today, that's the end of the introduction for Mi 11 Ultra. And with the lineup of Mi 11, there's Mi 11. And also the king of Android, Mi 11 Pro, and also Ultra of Android, Mi 11 Ultra. There is another one, which is the Mi 11 Lite 5G. And with this Mi 11 Lite 5G, I would like to invite Mrs. Wei Suqi to give us an introduction. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Lei. Hello, everyone. My name is Wei Suqi, and today, after the release of the two smartphones that have been released, and if you like a well-balanced Android flagship product, you can choose Mi 11 Pro. And if you like the、uh, cinematic camera, you can go for. Mi 11 Ultra, but if you are going for a thinner version with a delicate design, it is especially presented for young people who like lightweight products. Once you hold it, you will have this first feeling that it is really lightweight and really thin. So where does it come from? It is only 6.81 millimeter. It is actually the thinnest. 5G smartphone, and it is only 159 grams. So it is for a long time. 
since we have seen such a thing, smartphone, let's compare it to Mi 11. It is already really lightweight and thin, but once it's released, people are saying that it has a delicate, elegant appearance. But our Mi 11 Lite 5G, it is even 15.5% thinner, and it is also 37 grams lighter. So once you hold it in your hand, you will be impressed by how comfort it is. So it is the unquestionable thinnest smartphone from Xiaomi. And once I release that on my micro uh, blog, people are saying that they are a little worried because they are worrying about the power, the battery, because there are really thin smartphones that is not that reliable in terms of the battery life. So with this Mi 11 Lite, we have a battery of 4,250 milliamps. And from the very beginning, our goal was 4,200 milliamps. But then our structural engineer got a little motivated. They were thinking to challenge themselves with this extra 50 milliamps. And actually, in extreme environments, it could be really helpful. And so being slim and lightweight does not only make a difference to the grape when you hold it in your hand. And people are thinking that they are a little tired with the curved design on the back. But we, so that's why we are using this double 2.5D glasses on both sides to balance the grape comfort. And also, with Mi 11 Lite 5G, we are adopting the AG frosted glasses because if it's too refined, then you get too much fingerprints on it. But if it's too rough, then it would sacrifice the comfortness. That's why our designers did the collaboration and finally confirmed this 55% frost design. And as we have mentioned that it is lightweight and it is elegant, let's see how it really looks with the video clip. So how do you like it? So actually we have a wide color range for your choice. For example, this water blue, we've given it a really good name. It resembles the really refreshing mint. It's like taking a mint in summer. And also there are girls who would prefer a beautiful pink smartphone. So in this season with full cherry blossom, we would like to introduce to you this really gentle color. And white is a classic color. But additional from white, we are adding this warm touch to it. It's almost like a, a freshly peeled chili in, in summer. And if you want to show a low profile while not being boring, you can pick this classic black. And apart from this, we have two unique colors. The first one is the kiwi green. You can imagine that in a really hot summer day, it is like you're, you are surrounded by the fragrance of kiwi. The other one is even more unique. It is like when the sunshine is casted on a lemon, you can feel the sour and also the passion. So that's the full range with different six different colors. And so you can choose it with your own style and characters. So Mi 11 Lite 5G, it is ultra thin and lightweighted. It sports 4,250 mAh. It also comes in different color variants. So you can go to the Mi store and feel it in your hand and see if it is your favorite. Now let's look at display. First, we adopt the AMOLED display for flat display. Why AMOLED display? because we want it to be extremely thin and lightweight. AMOLED display is 
6.53mm thinner than the OLED display. It is also almost 1mm thinner than the LCD display. You can feel this 1mm in your hand. Even though we have to double the cost, we still want to use AMOLED display on this device. Sometimes it sounds like the light 5G means we have to degrade the version, but you know AMOLED display is only possessed by flagships. At the same time, another benefit of this of this display is extremely narrow bezel and extremely narrow bottom bezel. The three sides are only 1.88 millimeter, and the bottom bezel is only 2.75 millimeters. It is 50% um, narrower than the previous edition. And if we compare it with our competitors, when you hold the phone in the hand, your eyes will tell you how thin and how big the display is. So. The ultra thin bezel and the ultra thin bottom bezel are also things only the flagships have. And for the display, in terms of color, we have the one million color DCI-P3 color gamut, the uh, 90 hertz refresh rate. You have everything. And each Mi 11 Lite 5G before shipment, they will be calibrated for uh, they will be calibrated for true color display. So it, you will have very good viewing experience, whether watching video or browsing the Weibo. In addition, it is also boosted by the dual speaker to create a very good sound effect for you. In terms of camera, you know camera is a big issue for the lightweight and the thin device because we don't have enough space but we choose three practical cameras for you first is the HD main camera second is the ultra wide angle camera I think girls really love ultra wide angle last but not the least the best camera the telemacro lens you take this phone out no matter whether you're taking the picture of the scenery or when you're taking the picture of yourself or of a shop, everything will look great with the ultra wide angle camera. You will be able to get a picture that is full of tension and you can also take a very creative selfie with your friend. The telephoto camera can help you capture those ordinary details in life and make them so special. And uh, all three cameras have great hardware specs. When we talk to the user and ask them what kind of uh, features you want and uh, when you will use the camera, many young people say that they want the camera to be very good in night photo because sometimes when we go out with our friends we want to take a picture to memorize the moment therefore we will also support super night mode not just for the rear camera the front camera also supports the night mode so at party if you want to take a selfie sometimes it's difficult for you to take a clear selfie therefore we did a scenario test so we, went, uh, we created a scene that people often go to and we simulated the light condition. You see, this is a picture taken by iPhone. It looks good, but not that good. Now, this is the picture taken by Mi 11 Lite 5G. Bright, white, colorful, full of details. And this is outdoor. This is um, outdoor in the low light condition, and you see the performance of uh, Mi 11 Lite 5G, you can find the most beautiful yourself in the picture. In addition to the night mode, we also have natural beauty cam. It can keep all the fine details of yourself and remove those tiny flaws from the picture. For beauty cam, this time we made three improvements. First, many users say that I want to look white in the picture. But, right, but now, many pictures look pale white, which is not suitable for the girl. It is just like 
when girls go shopping, you need to buy yourself a uh, liquid foundation, and you need to choose different shades. So this time, we created eight filters for your complexion color. You can choose different co uh, complexion colors, white, yellow, or tan. You will always find one filter that suits you the best. In addition, you also have the shading palette where you can highlight your face, and we also have the makeup for men. Moreover, something that occurs to girls very often. Many girls use the front camera as a makeup mirror to see the details of the face and see if the makeup is perfect. But the pain point is, if I hold the camera too far away, I won't be able to capture all the details. If I hold it too close, it is uh, very inconvenient. Therefore, we adopt the two-time zoom selfie. So you can see all the details, and when you are doing makeup, you can see all the details of your face. So these are the features of our camera system. I only introduced some features of the camera system. It also have, has other interesting functions like the AI skyscaping, kaleidoscope mode, and AI clones. And we've got a video as a demonstration for you. We welcome all of you to use Mi 11 5G Lite to take your own pictures and share with us your suggestions and comments. Last but not the least, about experience, for ultra lightweight and thin mobile phone, people might be worried about the experience and performance. Many young people use the device to play games. So for Mi 11 Lite 5G, we will debut with Qualcomm Snapdragon 780G. This is the most powerful mobile platform, uh, seven series mobile platform, first five nanometer. After Snapdragon 888, this is the second uh, processor, this is the second chip pr processor with five nanometer uh, process. It's um, CPU structure, GPU structure, and AI structure are the same with the Snapdragon 888. So you can imagine how powerful the performance will be. So this is the benchmark score, over 560,000. So this is a leapfrog performance. You know, for the previous ultra lightweight and thin mobile phone, the benchmark score will only be 400,000. And also the battery life is not that good. So don't worry, for me, five, uh, for me 11 Lite 5G, you will have great energy efficiency and great performance. Also, we pay a lot of attention to heat dissipation. We adopt ultra-thin suspended heat pipe liquid cool technology. Features you like will all be retained on Mi 11 5, Lite 5G. You have Bluetooth, NFC, IR Blaster. Everything you like will be there in the Mi 11 Lite 5G. And the two accessories to introduce to you first is the Macron silica gel case. For different color variants, you can choose different colors of a Macron silica gel case. The second case is very interesting. It is called photochromatic case. Why do we call it this? Because this is a white case, but when sunlight hits on it, the color will shift. You see the color changing when sunlight hits on it. When you use it indoor, it is one color, but when you go outdoor, the color will change. Very interesting. So this is the Mi 11 Lite 5G. It is ultra thin, thin and lightweight. It is the thinnest and the most lightweighted mobile phone in the Mi history. It has great and powerful performance. It has the 6.55 inch AMOLED display 
It is powered by Snapdragon 780G. It also has great camera system. And we are very serious about developing this uh, device. So I hope all of you will love this smartphone. We have two prices. 8 plus 128 gigabyte, 2,299. And the 2,599 Chinese yuan for the 8 plus 256 gigabytes. So much about Mi 11 Lite 5G. Thank you very much. How do you like this smartphone? You might be worried about its performance, but actually, Snapdragon 780G is very close to the performance and the energy efficiency of uh, Snapdragon 870 with such a high-end processor plus the AMOLED display as two point, uh, which is 2.5D glass. Therefore, this device can be ultra-thin and lightweight. The developer's team actually redesigned a more lightweighted and thinner device for the young people. Maybe you think Mi 11 is not thin or lightweight enough. This time we make the thickness 6.81 millimeter. This is the thinnest and the lightest Mi product in the history so far. Four Mi 11 series have been introduced and uh, this is a comparison of the specs from Mi 11 to 11 Pro to 11 Ultra to 11 Lite 5G. So different users with different preferences will be able to find the phone you like. So back to this warm-up poster. Many people ask me, why do we name it Refresh? Maybe we can explain Refresh another time. But after I posted this poster, many people say that we are going to launch the new Mi Smart Band. Honestly, I didn't expect to launch a new Smart Band, but Mi Smart Band is indeed well received by the users. In six years, we have sold 120 million units around the world. Moreover, for the smart band, you can use it in your daily work. You can also wear it when you are doing exercises. So today, I'm going to introduce Mi Smart Band 6 to you. Beautiful, right? This time, the Mi Smart Band 6 comes in six color variants. You will always find your own choice. This time, Mi Smart Band 6, the biggest improvement is the 1.56 inch AMOLED running track inspired full screen display. So, in a small size and in a gorgeous shape. The shape of uh, this display is a running track and uh, the display size is increased by 50%. Moreover, precision of uh, this display is 326 ppi. This is an AMOLED display, so you will see things clearly. With this HD running track inspired display. We also prepared a, over 130 band displays for you, all kinds of band displays at your choice. In addition, among them, we also have 70 IP band display. Let's take a look at this one the SpongeBob. Cute, right? If you think the 
Fan display is not enough. You can also customize your own display. You can use the photo of your family. You can use the photo of your pet. All the photo of your idol as the display. Because this is a HD display, it's it will show all the details of the picture. Moreover, the Smart Band 6 can detect 30 exercise modes. It can also auto detect six fitness activities. For example, outdoor running, walking, treadmill running, cycling, indoor rowing, and elliptical training. So it can auto detect these six fitness activities. And I've been using the band for a while. I think it's really good to use. Last time when I used it while running, actually I was wearing the Smart Band 5, and I'm going to change it to the Mi Smart Band 6. And people are curious why I am not using the Smart Band 6 because I don't want to. Sp I don't want to spoil the secret. In addition to track your exercise and fitness activities, it can also comprehensively track and monitor your health condition. I will not elaborate on all of them, just give you some examples. We have 24-hour BP monitoring. This time, we also have the SPO2 tracking. For the SPO2 tracking, at night, Mi Smart Band 6 can also track your sleep breathing quality. It can help the patients suffering from sleep apnea. So if you wear this smart band, and it will be very useful. It can provide comprehensive monitoring of the health condition. Moreover, in six years, there are so many features and functions in Mi Smart Band, and I will not go into details. Just a couple of highlights. First is the 14-day battery life. It also has a long battery life mode, so it is up to 19 day battery life. Moreover, the magnetic charging, in the past charging is inconvenient, but with magnetic charging it will be very easy and convenient. Moreover, it is 50 meter waterproof, so when you go swimming or when you take a shower you can wear the Smart Band 6. For such a beautiful, high quality Smart Band, with the great performance. The price for the Smart Band 6 will be 229 Chinese Yuan. And Mi Smart Band 6 also has a special edition, that is the NFC edition. Now, NFC is being widely used. You can use it to take uh, public transport, you can use it to uh, open the doors, you can also use it to make payments. So for the NFC edition, the price will be 279 Chinese Yuan. So two editions for Mi Smart Band 6. The standard edition is 229 Chinese Yuan. The NFC edition will be 279 Chinese Yuan. If you love doing exercise, you can use it. And this time, we also want to give out some um, Mi Smart Band 6 as a gift to our Mi fans. In WeChat, you can search for Mi 11, and if you and you follow the public account of Xiaomi, so every night we will send out 10 Mi Smart Band 6, and we will continue this activity for 24 hours. So we will send out 240 Mi Smart Band 6 to our Mi fans. So it has been two hours for these uh, spring new products release, and uh, let's have a recap of the product released already. We released three smartphones, Mi 11 Pro, Mi 11 Ultra, and Mi 11 Lite 5G. In addition, we also launched the best of the best router today, the AX9000, as well as the latest Mi Smart Band 6. Of course, the 8-watt wireless charging 
and the multi-coil charging pad. Of course, along with a group of cases, I really love the photochromatic case for Mi 11 Lite 5G. The color will change on the sunlight. This is interesting. So we have launched so many products. So for sales, from 10 p.m. tonight, we will start the pre-sale. From 10 a.m., the 2nd of April, we will start official sales through all channels. But one thing different, the Mi 11 Lite 5G, the sales will start on the 16th of April. So to say it again, Mi 11 Pro, Mi 11 Ultra, the AX9000 and the Mi Smartband 6, the pre-sale will start at 10 p.m. tonight. And from 10 a.m. on the 2nd of April, we will start the official sales. And for the Mi 11 Lot 5G, the sales will start on the 16th of April. Now, we have covered so many great products. Yesterday, I made some dig. This spring release will cover 16 products. Therefore, we have to rearrange the schedule, and some of the new products will be released via Weibo. But still, we've got a lot to talk about. So the entire release could be four or five hours long. I believe that Mi fans who support Xiaomi and the friends from media who support Xiaomi will stay with us until midnight and even 1 a.m. tomorrow. Here, I would like to thank all of you. Thank you very much. But there is a challenge for me. I got a cold yesterday. I couldn't even speak at noon today. Therefore, we had a talk today. I know you are all excited about Mi Mix, as well as the Surge C1 chip, as well as the new the roadmap for Xiaomi in the next 10 years and more new products, and I want to talk about them in details, so I hope you can understand. This spring new product release will be divided into two parts. At 7.30 p.m. tomorrow, we will continue the spring new product release. I will go back and have a good rest. So I would like to thank all the friends participating in today's release and see you tomorrow night at 7.30 p.m. Thank you very much.
Hey everyone, welcome to our Xiaomi Global new product launch. My name is Daniel. Now for those of you who tuned into our China launch today, stay online because we've still got some pretty big surprises for you. Today, for our global users, we're going to be announcing five new products, three smartphones, each that are going to offer a best of the best in a specific category. We're going to have a new way to stay fit and a totally new type of cinema. Now, that's all for preamble or fanfare. Let's dive right into the best part, the product. Today, first, let's talk about the best of the best. This is a device that's built for the real enthusiast. Now, the director's cut is what an artist truly envisions for their work. And that is exactly what Mi 11 Ultra is, our vision. Let's quickly go over what makes Ultra so, so Ultra. First, Mi 11 Ultra is made of ceramic. If you didn't know, ceramic is very strong, very unique. Hand feel is exceptional and it allows for wireless charging, like glass. Now our second color, Ceramic Black. This is my personal favorite, and it really reminds me of our history as one of the first companies to implement ceramic in our flagship devices. This is a very unique build, one that made it from concept to mass production. As I said, we built this with enthusiasts in mind, and it features a very unique rear. Now, some of you may recognize this butterfly. This is the perfect way to showcase our rear always on display. This is a new feat of engineering for us and required completely rethinking how we arrange and optimize the internals of our device. But it's not just gorgeous, it's also really functional. Besides being used as an always on display, you can now use it to use, preview your selfies. You can now shoot easily with your rear camera, the full power of your rear camera, or you can check your notifications at a glance. We've also implemented super power saver mode. This is going to allow you to massively diminish the power consumption for emergency moments by using only the rear display for basic functionality. Pretty amazing. Now, one thing I've been asked a fair few times, what about IP rating? Truth be told, many of our devices offer some measure of dust and water resistance. But this time, we've officially certified Mi 11 Ultra as IP68, meaning you can worry less and shoot more. Now, speaking of shooting, I'm not overselling this when I say that we're setting a new precedent for camera capabilities. Typical smartphone cameras feature one primary and then supporting lenses. Mi 11 Ultra, however, offers three sensors that are not only as good as typical primary sensors, but well beyond them. First, the primary sensor. This primary sensor is massive. For reference, a typical digital camera is going to feature a sensor that's about one inch in size. This is very nearly the same size. What that means is you're going to have digital camera quality in a smartphone. Now, some of you may have been waiting for us to release a Periscope camera. Our Periscope camera is going to offer 120 times zoom. This is a massive leap forward for us. How this works. Light, which is the image that you're taking is shifted 90 degrees through a prism. What happens then is it travels through here, a much longer distance than typical smartphone lenses. This allows a much higher degree of zoom than typical lenses. Finally, our ultra wide angle. Most competitor smartphones offer relatively low resolution ultra wide angles and angles as low as 119 degrees. Now we've greatly exceeded each of these factors for much wider much clearer ultra wide photos. So, marketing is marketing and reality is reality. I could tell you all day that this is the best camera we've ever made, but I'd rather you hear it somewhere else. DxO Mark has been reviewing the best smartphone cameras for multiple years, and they have given Mi 11 Ultra the very highest photo score ever. My first camera phone years and years ago was 0 0.3 megapixels. How far have we come? Mi 11 Ultra keeps up with and outperforms professional imaging devices and has changed the way that I personally 
look at mobile photography. It's going to be available very soon through a variety of channels, including our carrier partners. So stay tuned for more details. Now at the beginning of 2021, we had the absolute pleasure of introducing our new flagship, Mi 11. Mi 11 was the beginning of a new direction for our flagship series. The key word there being series. So alongside Mi 11 Ultra, Mi 11 is movie magic. It offered premium video, camera, audio, and one of the world's very best displays. It was incredibly received by both fans and media. And now today, we're going to be completing the Mi 11 series. We're going to be making four different devices available, each with a different focus. Alongside our Mi 11 Ultra and Mi 11, we're going to be introducing a new star performer and one final device that's really going to let you show your style. But first, let's start with the star performer. This is our best in-segment value for performance. Mi 11i. Now you might be wondering what sets I apart. To put it simply, we took the best features from Mi 11, camera, display, audio, performance, and created Mi 11i. That's why Mi 11i is the star performer. Every single feature was carefully handpicked to give you a star performing experience. Without further ado, let's start with camera. They say that the best camera is the one that you have with you at all times. And so for Mi 11i, we're excited to offer you 108 megapixels. This is one of the highest resolution camera sensors available today. This 108 megapixel camera uses the advanced HM2 sensor. This sensor is much, much bigger than typical sensors. What a bigger sensor means is more room for pixels and higher light intake overall. But let's let the photos speak for themselves. Using the 108 megapixel sensor, you can take breathtaking scenery shots like this. What's so amazing about 108 megapixels is that it's so packed with information, you can zoom and still have a high resolution photo. For instance, not only can you get a crystal clear shot of the pianist here, but also the saxophone player. And if you zoom in on another section, you can even see this audience member checking out that sax player. Photography at the end of the day it's just another form of storytelling. Mi 11i doesn't just take photos, it tells a story. Behind that 108 megapixel sensor is advanced nine in one bidding technology. How this works is that it combines multiple pixels of the same color into one larger pixel to capture more light. What this means in practical terms is that pictures captured with Mi 11i are much clearer in low light environments. And with night mode, you can really capture crystal clear pictures in low light settings. Pretty amazing, right? So there you go. 108 megapixels, one of the highest resolutions available to date. Seven piece lens construction for a sharper image and nine in one pixel binning technology for super clear low light shots. Mi 11i also comes with an ultra wide camera. This helps you capture more of the scene. Photos captured in ultrawide 
It just looked cooler. And it can also help you balance and compose your architectural shots. Mi 11i also features a tele macro camera. What this does is let you capture detailed close up shots from further away. Now, what's special about a tele macro camera this time is that you can shoot time lapse videos with it too. So, to demonstrate this, to demonstrate the quality of our tele macro camera, we've partnered with Beauty of Science. This is an organization that creates visually engaging science, education, and tech content. Together, we're able to capture some pretty fine details. Let's take a look. Mi 11i, three cameras that let you capture like a star performer. But you might be wondering, what's this little circle here next to the ultra wide camera? This is actually a zoom in microphone. This enables a totally new feature. We call it audio zoom. This is gonna change the way that you record videos. And how it works is that as you pinch to zoom in on the subject in your video recording, the sound of that subject is gonna be amplified as well. Let me demonstrate. I'm usually more of a dog person, but even I have to admit that cat was pretty cute. To make audio zoom work, we had to install three microphones on the top, bottom, and rear camera of Mi 11i. Sound signals are recorded from all three microphones and then combined through an algorithm. This allows us to triangulate on sounds as you zoom in while attenuating all other sound. Typical smartphones, they usually just have two microphones. So your subject sound is suppressed by surrounding noise and your hardware is unable to determine the position that audio originates from. On the front, we have of course included a highly clear 20 megapixel front camera. This takes the self out of selfies, letting everyone in the photo really pop. Now Mi 11i doesn't just capture amazing photos. We're also excited to give you premium cinematic features that are also found in our Mi 11. With Mi 11i, you can shoot studio level AI cinematic effects, such as time freeze. This is a video feature that enables you to freeze just part of your video in real time. Let's take a look. incredible, right? We also have freeze frame. This freezes and clones different frames to create the illusion that parts of you are frozen in time.
This and all the other AI cinematic effects that let you create star performances with just a single click. Besides AI cinema, Mi 11i also gives you advanced, yet very, very easy to use, studio level editing software. Take a look at just how easy that is. Just a couple clicks for amazing videos. Mi 11i is perhaps the most complete tool to create star performances. Besides what we talked about today, we also have those very easy to use features such as time lapse, long exposure, and dual video. Mi 11i also lets you record ultra night video. Let's take a look at some of the possibilities you're going to be able to explore with our ultra night video mode. Finally, to cap it all off, Mi 11i is going to let you record in 8K. 8K, for those of you who don't know, is four times the pixels of 4K. Above all else, what that means is incredible levels of detail. Mi 11i is ready for Hollywood captures. It has a powerful 108 megapixel triple camera that's ready to shoot the perfect shot at any occasion. It also comes with an array of studio level video tools, such as audio zoom. It also lets you record in 8K and ultra night video mode. Total package. Now, next, Mi 11i is also ready with a big screen. First, I can confidently say that Mi 11i is Xiaomi's best flat display ever. Curved displays, they're not for everybody. And we wanted a top tier flat option for our flagship users out there. Sometimes flatter is better. Not only is it more practical, it prevents accidental mistouches along the edges. Now, Mi 11i's large display also comes with a high 120 hertz refresh rate. This essentially means that the screen is able to refresh 120 times per second. This makes your scrolling and viewing experience seamlessly smooth. Combined with that refresh rate, we also have a fast 360 hertz touch sampling rate. What this does is give you a highly responsive touch screen. This is a very important feature for anybody who games. Now, for Mi 11i, we're also using an industry-leading E4 AMOLED display. E4 is actually one of the latest and most advanced OLED screens in the market right now. The first benefit of this is that it can greatly reduce power consumption by up to 15% compared to previous generations. That means you can enjoy your favorite content for longer. Now, when compared to competitor LCD smartphones with lower contrast ratios, Mi 11i is able to produce deeper, near-perfect blacks and brighter colors. This gives you a realistic, lifelike viewing experience. With an E4 AMOLED, Mi 11i is able to give you one of the highest peak brightnesses available, 1300 nits. A smartphone with high nits is actually very, very important because it allows you to view your smartphone even on bright, sunny days. Now, not only will you be able to see it clearly in bright environments, Mi 11i allows you to see clearly and comfortably in almost any environment. To do this, we have introduced true display technology. Mi 11i's display is able to adapt automatically the display color temperature based on your surroundings. To detect the color temperature of your surroundings, we installed a dedicated ambient light sensor behind the display panel. So when you're at a cafe, the color is usually warm, right? So Mi 11i's true display detects this warm color and automatically adapts the color temperature of your smartphone display to give you a more relaxed viewing experience. Conversely, 
Mi 11 i's display will also adapt to colder color temperatures. So when you're in an environment like your office. Besides giving you the most optimal color temperature based on your settings, Mi 11 i also gives you one of the most accurate display colors available with our true color technology. Mi 11 i is tuned to expertly pro-level color accuracy. This is measured using two metrics, JNCD and Delta E. For both of these metrics, any number below a one means that there's no noticeable difference in color from your display and the original source. And you want to enjoy vibrant colors when you're watching videos too, right? So we ensured that Mi 11 i also lets you watch your favorite content in HDR 10 plus. Unlike HDR that has a color and brightness setting fixed on every single frame, HDR 10 plus gives each frame of your video treated to its own set of colors, brightness, and contrast parameters. This gives you a lifelike viewing experience through dynamic tone mapping. But what if the resolution of your video is low to begin with? I think everybody's had this problem before. You go on a streaming video site and the highest option is 360p. Mi 11i solves this problem with super resolution. This is AI technology that up to doubles the resolution of your content. What this does is take this clip for example. It scales up the resolution of your video to offer crystal clear clarity at any time. So, we weren't joking when we mentioned that this is Xiaomi's best flat display yet. With a leading 120 hertz E4 AMOLED display, robust software features such as True Color, HDR10+, and Super Resolution. Now, when compared with another competitor smartphone brand, you can clearly see that we're ahead in nearly every display spec. Now, we could spend the whole day telling you how great this display is, but that wouldn't be as convincing as hearing it from somebody else, yeah? So our display is officially graded by DisplayMate. Now, DisplayMate is a display certification organization. They are an industry standard of excellence for image and picture quality. They ran dozens of proprietary tests and calibration patterns with the Mi 11i. And as a result of their testing, Mi 11i was graded A+. This is the very highest grade from DisplayMate and an honor for us, actually. In fact, Mi 11i was able to set, funnily enough, 11 remarkable records on the DisplayMate indexes. These categories include measurements of image shift to peak luminance and cover top level details like contrast and color accuracy. So Mi 11i is truly a star performer on display. From the hardware to software, we strive to create the best display experience possible for you. And we're super proud to have accomplished it for you on the Mi 11i. Now, we didn't stop with just making our display amazing. Once we checked display, we moved on to audio. So we asked ourselves, how do we give our users the best possible audio experience? So the first thing we had to give you, dedicated dual speakers. This just means bigger, louder sound, but most importantly, stereo capabilities. For the first time ever in Mi series, we are very proud to announce that Mi 11i has built in Dolby Atmos. This is cinema surround technology and the type that you'll usually find in professional movie theaters. To further improve your audio experience, Mi 11i also supports high-res audio and high-res audio wireless so that you can always experience superior sound quality as opposed to compressed audio formats. Mi 11i also supports the latest Bluetooth 5.2, which means your smartphone can simultaneously connect to multiple earphones or speakers. Mi 11i is all about making flagships available to more people. And we are very excited to let you know that Mi 11i is going to be powered by the latest Qualcomm Snapdragon 888. Now, this processor is built on world leading 5 nanometer process technology. This lets you pack even more transistors and components onto a tiny, tiny chip. What this means in practical terms is that Mi 11i delivers higher processing power and allows your phone to run more smoothly. In the current market, 
5 nanometer process technology is only available on relatively expensive flagship devices. The Snapdragon 888 also sports a Cortex X1. This focuses on maximizing performance. In tandem with the Cortex A78, designed for high-end performance and high efficiency. GPU graphics rendering is 35% faster, and it's all supported by the sixth generation Qualcomm AI engine. This AI engine is 73% faster and boasts a remarkable 26 tops. So, what's a tops? 26 tops means 26 trillion operations per second. That is a whole bunch of operations. But why do you need them? AI is always running behind the scenes on your phone, powering nearly every single feature you use day to day, from photography to video to display and battery optimization. Mi 11i is also a multitasking superstar. UFS 3.1, large storage capacity, and incredible write and read speeds. We combine this with LPDDR5, so everything you need to perform is at your fingertips when you need it. Combining all this power, Mi 11i was able to achieve an Antutu score of over 740,000. This makes it one of the world's very fastest devices. Now, with an integrated X60 modem, Mi 11i, of course, features 5G capabilities. To make that even more convenient, though, if you need two SIM cards, you want the fastest. So Mi 11i also offers dual 5G standby. And support for leading Wi-Fi 6 connectivity. Wi-Fi is so integrated into our daily lives. We actually take it for granted. But with Wi-Fi 6 capability on Mi 11i, you can watch videos when you want. Indulge in more gaming, listen to more music, no interruptions. Because of how we engineered this on Mi 11i, our Wi-Fi 6 is actually improved in both superior performance when compared to those of competitors. It's so fast that you can download a one gigabyte movie in just a few seconds. So Mi 11i is truly fast and powerful, but you gotta stop sometimes, right? What if you need to take a quick break? No problem. Mi 11i is powered by 33 watt pro charging. Unlike previous generations, Mi 11i's 33 watt pro fast charging is more power efficient and enables faster charging thanks to upgrades in MiFC, IC, and MMT technology. In fact, when we compare it to competitor 33 watt charging, Mi 11i's 33 watt pro is almost 30% faster. With a flagship Snapdragon 888 processor, 5G dual SIM, UFS 3.1, LPDDR5, and finally, lightning fast 33 watt pro charging. Mi 11i really puts the performer in star performer. Last, let's talk about design. Now, you may have already noticed, but Mi 11i adopts a brand new design philosophy. What really does it for me is this new colorway. This color is versatile. As you can see here, this silver features a gradient finish, which changes color at different lighting angles. This gives it a pearlescent feel that's totally unique among smartphones today. There you got it. Celestial Silver, the ultimate showstopper. Mi 11i also comes in an elegant frosty white color for a clean yet classic appeal. And then we have Cosmic Black, practical, timeless, perfect for you minimalists out there. Here are the three glamorous colors of the Mi 11i again. We have Cosmic Black, Frosty White, and Celestial Silver, ready to take on the big stage. Now, the first thing you may notice is that Mi 11i shares the iconic Mi 11 halo ring design. But to reflect modern practicality, we've also adopted a brand new camera housing with clean, rounded, and uncluttered surfaces. Mi 11i is also designed with a premium frosted glass matte finish. This will give you a smooth feeling texture for a superior feel as you hold your phone. That sleek feel is accompanied with a 3D curved back finish. This gives you an ergonomic yet comfortable grip. 
This makes gaming, photography, more secure and enjoyable over long periods. Now, details matter when it comes to design. And so we're proud to have accomplished one of the tiniest dot displays in the market so far. Just how tiny is this dot display? It, in fact, it's so small that it's even smaller than a single grain of rice. Some of you might know, Xiaomi actually means small rice to reflect our humble origins. Of course, we didn't stop there. As well as the tiny dot display, we also made the chin even smaller. The ultimate goal here is to give you a near, full display, immersive viewing experience. Now, Mi 11i is truly a beautiful device, but it's also functional. For example, for Mi 11i, we made the decision to add a side fingerprint sensor. This actually serves two purposes, allowing you to unlock and turn off your phone. We also made sure Mi 11i was designed slim and sleek. So it's comfortable in your hand, but it's also really easy to slip into your pocket. Also, it's as light as our Mi 11. What really makes this weight impressive is what our Xiaomi engineering team was able to fit inside. A massive battery. It requires exceptional planning to do this while still maintaining thinness and lightness. And Mi 11i features a 4,520 milliamp hour battery that lasts up to two days of usage. Mi 11i, the star performer with an all-star design. Clean, yet premium. We built this for everyday practicality and functionality. So, not only is Mi 11i beautiful, it features four flagship specs that really matter. Flagship camera, flagship display, flagship audio, and flagship chipset. Finally, what you've all been waiting for, the price. This is Mi 11i, the star performer. Today, flagship phones are really, really expensive. And at launch, some of them even costed over a thousand euros. Any guesses on Mi 11i pricing? Mi 11i is going to start at a startling 649 euros, full RRP. It's gonna be available first through our channel partners. Now, channel availability may vary between markets, so don't miss out. We're also gonna be working with a variety of carrier channels as well to make Mi 11i as available as possible. With more details coming soon. So, again, Mi 11i, available in two different variants and co still costs about half the price of competitor flagships the Star Performer with all-star value pricing. The Star Performer made a big statement on a big stage today with big specs and big features. More details to follow soon on our regional official social media channels. That brings us to a close for Mi 11i, the Star Performer. But we have more exciting announcements for you today. For that, I'd like to pass things off to Abby Go. Abby? Thanks, Daniel. Hey everyone, Abby here. I'm very, very excited to be with all of you today. Let's dive right in. The Mi 11 series is one of the best looking devices ever. Inspired by Xiaomi's iconic flagship design, we wanted to carry forward with this unique design language. Mi 11 was already one of the lightest flagships on the market, but we couldn't help but think, what if we made it lighter? So today, we'll be introducing Mi 11 Lite. This unique device is going to let you show your style. Style is an individual concept. That is why we'll be introducing a variety of fresh colors with more options than we've ever had before. First, for our 5G variant, we have mint green. This color is as fresh as the cool mint teas, refreshing and chill. And just looking at it, I could almost taste it. It's truly a wonderful color. Match it with other lighter shades for the perfect color accessory. Up next, we have Truffle Black. Every phone these days has a black variant, but none quite as exquisite as this one. Truffles, as you know, are a very rare and difficult to find delicacy. It's soft and elegant, simple and tasteful. 
Match with bright colors for a subtle statement or keep it simple. Whatever you're wearing, Mi 11 Lite 5G in truffle black will easily complement your outfit. Next, we have a zesty, bright, and lively citrus yellow. Mi 11 Lite 5G also comes in this perfect citrus yellow color. You make a statement with everything you do. Like all citrus, it's a perfectly bright combination of sour and sweet. This color is not for the faint of heart. I really envy people who has the flair to rock this one. However you do it, show your style with Mi 11 Lite 5G. You have the exquisite truffle back, cold mint green, and the lively citrus yellow. Now, we didn't let the 5G variant have all the fun. Mi 11 Lite also comes in a jaw-dropping bubblegum blue. I really, really like this color because it reminds me of cotton candies at the fair. Next, this color is love at first sight. Mi 11 Lite is a fusion of peach and pink, forming distinct shades when viewed from different angles. Colors have a way of making you feel things, and this makes me feel like making something really wonderful. Peach pink is made for those who want to make a statement. And finally, we have the boba black, inspired by the iconic tapioca pearls found at the bottom of your bubble tea. This color goes with any style, just the way a bubble tea goes with any situation. Six different colors for six totally different looks there's going to be a Mi 11 Lite that's perfect for your style. Mi 11 Lite is fit for any outfit, and we've got an entire palette of colors to match your lifestyle. Let's see it. So here we can see for our 5G variant, we have the mint green, citrus yellow, and the truffle black. Really gorgeous. And for our 4G variant, we have the bubblegum blue, peach pink, my favorite, and the boba black. Beyond looking stylish, Mi 11 Lite also feels stylish. At just 159 grams, Mi 11 Lite 5G is incredibly light, making it really easy on your hands on a day-to-day -day basis. In general, people spend more than three hours holding and using their smartphones, so you definitely want something that sits well in your hand. But we can do a tiny bit lighter. Just 157 grams for our 4G variant. And to put that into perspective on just how light it is, it's even lighter than an apple. Literally. This makes it one of the lightest smartphones in the world, as you can see. And in fact, it's lighter than this apple too. And to give a sense of scale, Mi 11 Lite not only looks better than almost anything on the market today, it's also lighter. Mi 11 Lite isn't just stylish and light, it's also trimmed to be slim. In fact, it's 14% slimmer than the previous generation. Measuring in less than 7mm, it's so slim you'll barely notice it in your bag. And it's going to be super easy to slip even into tight pockets. But how slim is 6.81 millimeter exactly? It's even slimmer than some of the mini options in the market today. And slimmer than all of these recently launched smartphones. With such a slim phone, you may think that the camera bump must be relatively huge. But it's hardly there at all, at just 1.7 millimeter, from top to bottom. The phone itself is really, really slim. The camera is really slim but we also made sure that the bezels are, you guessed that right, pretty slim as well. For you designers and artists out there, we all know that symmetry is important for the right aesthetic. That is why Mi 11 Lite features slim symmetrical bezels on the top and side. We're also including a side fingerprint sensor for fast and easy unlocking. At Xiaomi, every detail matters. The side button is also decided to be slightly curved so it feels more comfortable when unlocking. That's the Mi 11 Lite. It's colorful, it's slim, it's light, and of course, it's stylish. Definitely my favorite accessory of 2021. We didn't stop with just a stunning phone. Mi 11 Lite also sports a powerful camera system for capturing wonderful moments. 
Inside of that super slim camera bump, we've included a very capable triple camera. This camera system sports a high resolution 64 megapixel main sensor, telemacro lens, and ultra wide angle lens. This means it's going to be more than ready to capture any angle. So you could fill your feed with fantastic photos. And besides photos, now more than ever, we're taking more and more videos too. That is why we're going to be featuring flagship Mi 11 series cinematics. You can't always wait for the right weather. And with AI Skyscaping 3.0, you can say bye-bye to bad weather and hello to good weather. AI Skyscaping 3.0 lets you create gorgeous videos from any photo really easily or stay still with unique background photo effects. Time is our most precious resource and Mi 11 Lite will give you full control of how you show this with Pro Time Lapse. This allows you to customize a variety of parameters without overcomplicating shooting. We've also included other Insta-worthy feature from our Mi 11, One Click AI Cinema. This is going to make it super easy to take stand-up videos with just one click. Pretty simple, right? And to save time on editing, our professionally tuned filters have been specifically selected to make sure that there's a filter that's right for any style. Lastly, we also included our all new vlog mode. With this, you could take multiple shots from different times and places and make one awesome video. For me personally, this is perfect for travel dogs. Let's check out this awesome video shot by David Alorza, our me creator from Argentina. Cold life is a windy road. Finally, for you selfie lovers out there, Mi 11 Lite takes phenomenal selfies as well. With great camera and powerful AI software, it really helps you make your outfit of the day pop. Snap your style with Mi 11 Lite's incredible camera system. You can capture wonderful moments with a 64 megapixel triple camera, plus great videos with Mi 11 series video software features. A bit of attitude could go a long way. And Mi 11 Lite is attitude on display. Curved displays aren't right for everyone. And Mi 11 Lite sports a flat AMOLED display. For those who prefer a bright, flat AMOLED, this is the one for you. We've also upgraded the reverb face this generation, upping it to a 90 Hz AMOLED, the kind often found in flagships. This is perfect for scrolling social media or playing your favorite games. And We've also included a 240Hz touch sampling, so your use feels even smoother. Now, for those of you who shop online, you know the struggle. There's a big difference between different shades of red, and there's an infinite numbers of not just red, but all colors. That is why display accuracy is super important for superb style. Now, Mi 11 Lite display is awesome. It covers the DCI-P3, ensuring full compatibility with a wide range of content. Also included is 10-bit color, which increases the depth of colors displayed. Mi 11 Lite features HDR10, and Mi 11 Lite 5G offers HDR10+, Plus to make sure your display is bright and bold when you need it. All of these work synergistically to give you a beautiful viewing experience. And to keep all this light easy on your eyes, we've included some of our best light technology ever. A 360 degree sensor to detect external lighting and adjust brightness. Low blue light mode to ensure optimum eye health and paper reading mode that's great for reading marathons. Mi 11 light is really light on your eyes. There you go. Mi 11 light, 
a light device with an awesome flat 90 hertz AMOLED display, and many more. Now, for you high performance out there, you may be wondering whether we made compromises to make Mi 11 Lite so light. Spoiler, no. We made it lighter, we made it slimmer, but still, we made the battery bigger. Mi 11 Lite features a 4,250 milliamp hour battery, giving you around two days of battery life. And we've also incorporated a high speed 33 watt fast charging. And of course, we've also included the 33 watt fast charger. And for an on the go lifestyle, we've also included NFC. So you're worry free for cash free payments and card emulation. And of course, dual speakers for when you're keen to jam with friends. In our 4G variant, we've used the snappy Qualcomm Snapdragon 732G. This processor perfectly balances speed and power efficiency, and is great for browsing, chatting, and gaming. Now, for those of you who love to share online, 5G will let you start and share trends online faster than ever before. Mi 11 Lite 5G is going to feature the world debut of a brand new 5G processor, the brand new Qualcomm Snapdragon 780G. And beyond just 5G, this processor offers amazing speed and power efficiency and features top of the line five nanometer process tech, which is only found in flagships. And in fact, it's only found in the top offerings among silicone manufacturers. This is a huge leap for 7 Series processors. We're super happy to be offering this for the very first time in Mi 11 Lite 5G. And also, it has an amazing Antutu score of more than 567,000. This is really super impressive. Smooth speeds and fresh colors. Mi 11 Lite 5G is really something special. There you go, we have the Mi 11 Lite and Mi 11 Lite 5G, both pretty devices that offer pretty amazing specs with the core differences in the processor, 5G capability, and three unique stunning looks each. These phones really look really, really gorgeous. Let's take a look at Mi 11 Lite series in motion. Drops falling from the tree So far, so good This too isn't too big of a spoiler. Mi 11 Lite series will also feature a light price. Both feature some really amazing specs. 90Hz AMOLED, 64 megapixel triple camera, and a big battery. All in a slim, light package. Each in three super stylish colors. For our 4G variant, Mi 11 Lite will start at just 299 euros RRP. And it'll be available to a wide variety of channels worldwide. For faster sharing and connectivity, Mi 11 Lite 5G will start at just 369 euros RRP. More availability details to come, so stay subscribed to your local social media channels. And we're going to be making it available through a wide variety of carrier partners as well. So make sure you stay tuned. This is Mi 11 Lite and Mi 11 Lite 5G. Show your style. One of the best looking device we've ever created. Coming soon. Thank you all. Now back to Daniel. Thank you, Abby. This completes our Mi 11 series. It's a complete flagship series with a model for absolutely any need. Now, I have two more surprises for you. We've launched two amazing smartphones today, but we're also excited to launch our latest wearable band. It's gonna keep you one step ahead. Now, in case you didn't know, Xiaomi is still the number one band brand in the world. We honestly could not have achieved this without all of your support. This is what drives our motivation to constantly innovate and give you the latest technology. And so today, we're excited to announce Mi Smart Band 6. Now, you might be asking yourself, why is this one step ahead? First, 
Mi Smartband 6 is a step ahead because for the very first time in Mi Smartband history, we are finally able to give you a full screen AMOLED display. In fact, this display is almost 50% bigger as, and is going to allow you to see more and do more. Personally, I'm definitely a dog person, but we didn't stop with just upgrading the display size. We also upgraded the display resolution. This is one of the highest resolutions available in the wearable band market right now. It's going to give you an even clearer view of your display than ever before. Mi Smartband 6 is also available with six different colorful straps. Black, blue, orange, yellow, olive, and ivory. Colors fit for any occasion. Another big upgrade for the band is that we added 19 new exercise modes to monitor. There's literally almost a sport for everyone here to choose from. Now I've been testing the Mi Smart Band 6 for a few months now. And honestly, probably one of the most useful features is the auto fitness tracking modes. Mi Smart Band 6 can automatically detect six different exercises. Like when you hit the elliptical after a long day at the office. No need to set up fitness tracking, just get moving. In fact, Mi Smart Band 6 auto detects five other exercises outdoor running, walking, treadmill, cycling, and rowing. Now, many of you have been asking for this. Mi Smartband 6 now features SpO2 blood oxygen monitoring. Your blood oxygen level is a measure of how much oxygen your red blood cells are carrying. And combined with many other tracking metrics on the band, you can provide yourself with a deeper insight into your overall wellness. Now, Mi Smartband 6 is going to let you stay one step ahead with all of these new upgrades a full-screen, high-res AMOLED touch display that will let you see more and do more with less swiping. Finally, a step ahead in fitness and wellness with new exercise modes, SpO2, and sleep breathing tracking. Me Smartband 6, with major upgrades for you to be one step ahead in life, fitness, wellness, and more. Now available at only 44.99 euros. Lastly, we're also going to be introducing a new type of home cinema. I am excited to introduce Mi Smart Projector 2 Pro. It's everything you need to create your own smart home cinema. With autofocus from up to 40 degrees of left, right, up, or down, you can place your Mi Smart Projector 2 Pro in more places than ever to create the perfect home cinema. Mi Smart Projector 2 Pro will automatically keystone correct. So wherever you place it, the image is going to be natural and free of distortion. Senseless, instant focus means you can just place and play. Mi Smart Projector 2 Pro is instantly going to give you sharp, clear images. We call it a home cinema with good reason. Mi Smart Projector 2 Pro can create 1080p FHD displays of up to 120 inches. It's huge, right? Not only that, but upgraded dual speakers with support for Dolby Audio and DTS-HD is going to provide immersive cinema sound. That's not just cinema-worthy visuals and audio at night or in the dark. With up to 1300 ANSI lumens and HDR10, Mi Smart Projector 2 Pro easily provides crisp colors, great contrast, and high brightness, so you can enjoy your content all day long. Speaking of content, the Mi Smart Projector 2 Pro lets you simplify your entertainment experience with Android TV. Access over 400,000 movies and shows in a single place. And just ask Google to control your TV with your voice. Cast your photos, videos, and music from devices to your TV easily with the Chromecast built in. And you guessed it, we call it smart because it is a smart hub for your smart home. Google Assistant built-in provides easy access to your entire network of smart home devices. Just ask Google to turn off your robot vacuum or to kill the lights when it's time for the movie to start. So that's me, Smart Projector 2 Pro, your smart home cinema. It's going to be available soon from just 999 euros. But that's not all. Early bird pricing will start from just 899 euros. Be sure to stay tuned to your local social media channels for more information. Now, as a thank you to our Mii fans, 
We're going to be kicking off our Mi Fan Festival on April 6th. We're going to be offering incredible discounts, games, and activities through more than 70 online channels and 300 offline partners through many of our global markets. Make sure you check it out online on our official website, me.com, and in Mi stores. Now, Abby, if you could just join me for a second. Thanks, Daniel. Thank you, Abby. Today has been an amazing day. Five amazing products for our global users. We're looking forward to seeing you next time. Thank you all and see you soon. What you see here may feel a little like science fiction. But this is not fiction. This is technology. This is where smartphone communication performance is tested. All global mainstream operator networks are tested here. This is the Sarla. It simulates the effects of electromagnetic radiation on the body. Leading imaging expertise, enhanced by remote tuning. An anechoic chamber, exploring the limits of human hearing. Thousands of ambient light conditions to create the best of displays, overcoming challenges through unrelenting effort through perseverance and dedication, wisdom and craftsmanship, just to exceed your expectations. This is the birthplace of Mi 11. These are Xiaomi Laboratories. This is Xiaomi Technology Park. I've been a Mi fan for one and a half years. I am an English teacher. And in my free time, I also like to make a movie. I also believe in the future of uh, smartphone filmmaking. It's going to boost independent films and give chance to people who wouldn't have the chance before. Having that little bit of free time and committing it to something I feel very really strongly about. It makes me feel like I'm at my very special place to which I was born for. If you believe in passion and never give up, you will be surprised by what you can achieve.
you know, in the future, factories won't need people. They'll be able to run fully autonomously 24-7. In the future, machines will work independently, seamlessly coordinating like clockwork. In the future, factories will be sealed against even the smallest speck of dust. In the future, quality controls will be handled entirely by intelligent machines. In the future, a smartphone will be produced every second. The future needs our imagination, but more importantly, it needs our action. This is Xiaomi's one small step towards the future. The future has just begun. Xiaomi Smart Factory. What you see here may feel a little like science fiction. But this is not fiction. This is technology. This is where smartphone communication performance is tested. All global mainstream operator networks are tested here. This is the Sarla. It simulates the effects of electromagnetic radiation on the body. Leading imaging expertise, enhanced by remote tuning. An anechoic chamber, exploring the limits of human hearing. Thousands of ambient light conditions to create the best of displays, overcoming challenges through unrelenting effort. 
through perseverance and dedication, wisdom, and craftsmanship, just to exceed your expectations. This is the birthplace of Mi 11. These are Xiaomi Laboratories. This is Xiaomi Technology Park. I've been a Mi fan for one and a half years. I am an English teacher. And in my free time, I also like to make a movie. I also believe in the future of uh, smartphone filmmaking. It's going to boost independent films and give chance to people who wouldn't have the chance before. Having that little bit of free time and committing it to something I feel really strongly about. It makes me feel like I'm at my very special place to which I was born for. If you believe in passion and never give up, you will be surprised by what you can achieve. Did you know, in the future, factories won't need people. They'll be able to run fully autonomously 24-7. In the future, machines will work independently, seamlessly coordinating like clockwork. In the future, factories will be sealed against even the smallest speck of dust. In the future, Quality controls will be handled entirely by intelligent machines. In the future, a smartphone will be produced every second. The future needs our imagination, but more importantly, it needs our action. This is Xiaomi's one small step towards the future. The future has just begun. Xiaomi Smart Factory.
what you see here may feel a little like science fiction. But this is not fiction. This is technology. This is where smartphone communication performance is tested. All global mainstream operator networks are tested here. This is the SARLA. It simulates the effects of electromagnetic radiation on the body. Leading imaging expertise, enhanced by remote tuning. An anechoic chamber, exploring the limits of human hearing. Thousands of ambient light conditions to create the best of displays, overcoming challenges through unrelenting effort. Through perseverance and dedication, wisdom and craftsmanship, just to exceed your expectations. This is the birthplace of Mi 11. These are Xiaomi Laboratories. This is Xiaomi Technology Park. I've been a Mi fan for one and a half years. I am an English teacher. And in my free time, I also like to make a movie. I also believe in the future of uh, smartphone filmmaking. It's going to boost independent films and give chance to people who wouldn't have the chance before. Having that little bit of free time and committing it to something I feel very really strongly about. It makes me feel like I'm at my very special place to which I was born for. If you believe in passion and never give up, you will be surprised by what you can achieve. Did you know, in the future, factories won't need people. They'll be able to run fully autonomously 24-7. In the future, machines will work independently, seamlessly coordinating like clockwork. In the future, factories will be sealed against even the smallest speck of dust. In the future, Quality controls will be handled entirely by intelligent machines. In the future, a smartphone will be produced every second. The future needs our imagination, but more importantly, it needs our action.
This is Xiaomi's one small step towards the future. The future has just begun. Xiaomi Smart Factory.